What the fuck is going on here? Is the game glitching out on me? Keep moving. Okay. Hmm. Stop right there, Vault Dweller. I've been preparing for your arrival since you left us for dead in that car. Oh, hey there. I have to say, I'm impressed. When I met you, I would have never taken you. You've caught the swath of destruction across California. You've done things even the Enclave thought was impossible. But now, you're coming down deep. Why the hell did you do it, Chevy? You were the head of all security, one of us. The Colonel and I were never vault dwellers. The Wasteland Scouts stole Project Brazil's mutant containment serum. They also had healthy adults and children to recruit for the Enclave's genetic purity program. What the hell are you people? We are the guardians of the Enclave. Special commandos created to serve the president after the Great War. My father was a member of the government before it collapsed, and I was selected to receive an implant that filtered radiation. Now we're here to reclaim that technology and use the containment protocol to eradicate any creatures infected with the... which include... That joke's on YouTube. There is no president and then here won that war. Am I supposed to be on one of you? How? You're not. You were created by the super mutant father for some kind of twisted thing. Lucky for us, he had no idea what he was doing. Otherwise, you might represent him. Now it's time for us to end. We want to die, huh? Oh, fuck you. Oh, fuck me. Really? <laughs> and again, and again, and again, and until we get it right. Give me that. Going to tear her a new one, that's for sure. Perfect. Stop right there. Okay. I've given Screw you. Get rid of her. You never stood a chance against our United Might. have meant that's right great my intelligence is shit basically but whatever Okay, that works for me. I don't care less. I'm ready to end this once and for all. Where's that asshole? Mm-hmm. 
Okay, so that's not gonna work. Fuck the club. Fuck all this. Oh, looky here. If it isn't the little upstart from Vault 18. Oh, great. I've been looking forward to a second showdown with you. You killed 30 of my patriots. There. I bet you feel real proud traipsing across the wasteland. What does it take to kill you people? Holy water? A silver bullet? What are you? <laughs> well, didn't your pappy downstairs tell you? <laughs> You're just a Xerox of some dead guy he scraped off the kitchen floor. You're Project Brazil, the little parasite that could. You have the same experimental virus in your gut squirming around that we do. He installed one of the Enclave's top secret properties in you, and now the whole world is after your corpse. No super so bush is something like that was impossible with free war technology. Impossible? <laughs> like you ain't? An out of shape little nerd that can't even handle a vault ball turns into Captain Cosmos in a week. I've seen your handiwork scattered all over the wasteland. You have a death toll that'd make any general proud. Too bad you were born on the wrong side of some mutant line of genetic code. You'd make a fine weapon. Unfortunately for you, that line just ran. Third of your BS brag alpha, let's end this. Oh, that's real good, kid. <laughs> you and your toy robot's gonna take on a I killed you twice already. Now I know your secret alpha aim for his symbiotic organism. Oh shit. Really? That was it. Oh. Okay, so I did that. Now what? Who's shooting there? Oh, she's back. Oh, come on, stop it. You're embarrassing yourself. Oh, she's dead. Okay. Now what? Fuck me. Had enough of you assholes, that's for sure. Okay. Oh. Now I have to deal with the father. Okay, we have one last thing to take care of. When the engines ignite, it'll vaporize Bragg and Shep. It's attacked by Merv. It has five warheads inside, one for each FEV storage for Project Brazil will be dead. Don't be an idiot. These political madmen have no interest in the future. This missile will ensure that they're... Uh, fine, you convince me, but you have to get down there and make sure they are in position. I won't, I won't. Right. This isn't how I hoped it would end. 
but I can rest easy knowing this nightmare will finally be over. Good luck. Thanks. I'm only here until this job is done. God damn it, you punk ass mutant bastard! You think throwing me down this hole is going to defeat me? I'm invincible, unkillable. The red, white, and blue flows through my veins. Mm. You may think you've seen the last of me struck down this hole, but I will okay. go up there and kick your ass. So let's see, are we going for a chaotic, chaotic ending or? You're the Titan 5 instantly looks into the Death Bear in order to capture it for your allies. The Titan 5 is targeting to the Enclave FEV bases. The Titan 5 is targeting to the NCR bases. Well, you know. I'm kind of an asshole. Now what? Back to Kiva, okay. Oh, she's here, probably. I secured the mission, we should prepare the traps for an immediate counterattack. Then see if we'll be back, let's get back to base and bunker now. I have an atomic bomb and an itchy trigger finger. Talk to Senator Duville. Where's my, my medics? So, you finally worked your way out of the ass end of the beast. I can't take your reward. Head on up to Good Springs and you'll find it in the Gray's view. I know how you desert rats are when you suddenly stumble into wealth. We'll be seeing more of you in the future, I bet. How will it go, friends or allies? We'll see. I'll call you when the political shitstorm blows over. Good luck on your end of that chessboard. Alright. Did we just finish? Yep. The war for California is over. While the embers of Fort Dagger Point still glow, the raider tribes reorganize beneath the new Shi warlord and her seemingly invincible right hand. The NCR is more willing to deal with this new face leading the alliance, and over the course of a decade come to recognize the Shi as a powerful faction once again. The Shi alliance resettles in a town called Hopeville under your leadership hoping to use the town's nuclear arsenal just as they had in Dagger Point, but away from the infectious FEV that made the fortress unlivable. Not long after the town begins to prosper, the Fort Dagger Point key you kept with you all those years triggers the self-destruct on the town's arsenal of buried nuclear weapons. Your healing powers keep you alive, but slowly begin to wane after you crawl out of the newly created divide. What is left of the Raider tribes assimilate into Caesar's Legion, who go on to conquer 80 tribes in their drive for domination. The NCR soon faces their final revenge as the Legion marches on Hoover Dam, a familiar warrior leading the charge. As for you, the Legion makes a spectacle of your wild healing powers upon discovering your capabilities, but eventually decide to retire you before you become too powerful to control. 
Haunted by your past and chased by the NCR, you take up a mission to protect your tribe by making a backroom deal with a mysterious client among the Shebangs, who recently found a coveted platinum chip among their riches. You are tasked with taking the item to New Vegas. But along the path, you are ambushed by the double-timing mobsters that you long ago abandoned, and you find yourself driven to your knees next to a shallow grave in the desert. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink, dig? made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18 karat run of bad luck. Truth is, the game was rigged from the start. That was cool. I wish they put as much uh, polish into every corner of this mod as they did for the movies in it, like the ending movie and uh, the beginning when they attack the vault. Hmm. Okay, continue. Okay, what's next? That's it? Okay. Well. So that was Project Better Brazil, everybody. Thank you so much for tuning in for this series. If you watched the whole thing, then thank you double twice, thrice. Um, my final thoughts on this mod is... Uh, it's still in beta. I like the story. There are a few points that I uh, that I don't actually like that are very stupid. I feel, but oh, and it's very bug ridden at the moment. But overall, it's uh, when it's actually finished is uh, going to be a very very good mod, among the best I would say. If they just cut back a bit from uh, the battle heaviness, so they don't need to throw this many enemies at you at once. And if they correct some of the environmental uh, glitches, make it a bit more computer friendly overall, I think this is going to be among the top 10 or top 5 best quest mods ever created for New Vegas. And it was actually a breath of fresh air after Fallout 4. It really is a throwback to Fallout 1 and 2 with the style and humor and it gives a few wings to that too. Um, I may come back to the mod to run around a bit in the world to find some hidden surprises if I can. But until then, see you guys next time. I was Minji Cake. Bye bye.